Hey guys, LibertyMan20 here. I know this video is actually a day late getting up. Uh, last weekend we had a family barbecue and it took a lot out of us, more than I expected. Uh, we got home and just, I didn't have time to film. We were just tired. Uh, of course we had an upset baby. But uh, I did get to watch most of the game, actually on Saturday. Had some downtime. Uh, so my post-game review is pretty much this. I'm glad we won 42-41 on the blocked uh, field goal by Corbin Jackson. Great block. Uh, that's the third one in the last three years. Coastal in 2014. Last year against Gardner Webb in overtime and then this year. So it's been really great. Uh, my overall reaction was that we gave up a lot of yards. Uh, wasn't our best game as far as, um, you know, defensive-wise. But we have, you know, uh, we have Solomon and Ginty out and a couple others. So... Defense was kind of very thin, stretched thin, but we gave up a lot of plays. There were so many personal fouls, unsportsmanlike conducts. I think what I saw was we had six penalties for 65 yards for penalty yards. It was rough. Um, they did a good job. Indiana State did a good job of kind of getting a buckshot out of his rhythm a little bit, forcing him to make bad throws. So that was kind of something that they probably need to work on. Um, Indiana State, it was a great game. I do wish I could have gone, but you know, family comes first. Um, that seems to be the most exciting game we've had this year, so I'm, that was pretty interesting. Uh, I did really, really enjoy watching the rest of the game that I could. I'm um, glad we won. We're 3-0 for the first time since 2008. Hopefully we can go 6-0, maybe even undefeated. I know I probably shouldn't say that, but you never know. Uh, this week is Jacksonville State. We are actually not favored. We are actually a 13.5 point underdog. Um, I think we can win. We'll see what happens. Uh, a few things. I'm working on a new intro, so that's something that's coming new on this channel. Uh, I got some good footage from the Moorhead State game that I'm putting in. Hoping to get more when we uh, play at home next, I think it's next week. Uh, so we'll see how that goes. I'm excited. I am doing a video this week uh, when it comes to Jacksonville State. I'll do another game prep video. It's going to be a little different. My wife has to work, so I have my son Noah. So that's going to be interesting and fun. But thanks, guys. I just want to give a quick update on what I thought of the Indiana State game. Hoping we can play better and go 4-0. Uh, yeah, it's good to be back. Sorry this was a, um, this video was a day late getting up. You know, it's just work <laughs> and, uh, you know, weekend. Thanks, guys. Uh, stay tuned for next week, for next Monday when I do the Jacksonville State game. This is Liberty Bant 20, and every day is game day.